Hello everybody, my name is Alfred Jarrett. I'm about to head to Fredericksburg, Virginia to talk to Kwani's dad and ask him for his daughter's hand in marriage. So basically I wanted to do something that was important to her family, which was they have a military background. So I decided to write out a warno, which is a warning order. And that's basically how they, what they use in the military to like issue warnings, warning orders or operations or basically about how things are gonna go. And that's how they let their troops know what the operation orders are gonna be. So I'm basically gonna go up there. I'm heading up there now. Hopefully all goes well. Hopefully he says, yeah. Just wish me luck. Getting a little bit nervous right now, so hope everything goes well. Yeah. We all saw the mother go in, issue him his warning. Yeah, There's a storm? Yeah, I'm about to grab, you gotta grab your pen and paper. For what? I'm about to issue you a war note. A war, a war note? Yeah, a war note. What's going on, young man? What's going on? What's that about? Come on, you gotta, I gotta issue a war note. Grab your pen and paper. What you videoing? What you videoing? It's for a movie. Huh? It's for a movie. What kind of movie? For him. And you are who? Claude. Claude? Yes, sir. What kind of movie you got going on? <laughs> a documentary, actually. Oh, okay. Do I need to open it? Yeah, you need to open it. Do I need to get a lawyer? No. <laughs> no. We got it sealed. I ain't abusing. I should have bought the open one. <laughs> All right. Enemy forces. All right, so the situation. Oh, this is a sit rep? Yeah. Okay. Situation, the enemy forces. Many battles have been faced throughout Jaquan and Alfred Jarrett's relationship, but over the past four years, we have learned to defeat each of the enemies. The following three were poor communication, finances, and trust. With poor communication, we have crossed these enemies every, every day for the past four years. We went from living five hours away to two hours away in the same home. Through these various living situations, we figured the best weapons in our arsenal to use against this enemy with finances. We have learned how to save save more and be more eco economically wise. We have also motivated each other to have more of a go-getter mindset so that later our future family will not have to struggle. Trust, we have defeated this enemy by being consistent, being fair, being considerate, being honest, and being reliable. Friendly forces, God, I've always been taught that God should be first in every relationship. Second, family. One of the most important values to me is family. All my life I've been, I've been the one in my family that tries to keep everyone together because it is what is most important to me. I have watched how you carry yourself and as a head of your, house, of your family and I look to do the same with your daughter, Jaquana. Growing up, I was positioned, positioned to, field, to fill the head of the household role due to a lack of a father figure in the home. Therefore, I have experienced providing for my family at an early age. Next, Jamie Lott, the identical twin sister of Jaquana Lott, may not be in attendance due to military obligations. Aaliyah Edwards, age seven, the oldest niece of Jaquana, located in Bradenton, Florida with Jaquana's oldest sibling, Anthony Edwards, and loves spending, spending her summers with Auntie Kwani in Virginia. Jasmine Harrington, the oldest sorority sister of D Delta Sigma Theta and a close friend of both Jaquana and Elfer that planned the event where, the f where we both first met. Megan Barnes, roommate and college teammate on the JMU track and field team. Next we have Adrena May, close friend and sorority sister in Delta Sigma Theta, who was also her teammate on the JMU track and field team. They refer to each other as PUD may not be in attendance due to military obligations. The mission, what? To receive, re, to re, to receive approval of First Sergeant James Lott for Jaquana Lene's Lott hand in marriage. Once approval is granted, you shall proceed. How, an engagement ceremony that is 
the traditional formal way of proposal in the country of Sierra Leone, West Africa, who will be involved. Involved will be the, the Lot family and the Jarrett family, where the ceremony will be executed at the home of the Lot the lots in Fredericksburg, Virginia, no later than Saturday, June 3rd, 2017, between the hours of 1600 and 1700. Why? In order to establish a success, successful future and bring together two impacting forces, execution. The Jarrett family will arrive at the location of the Lot family. The Jarrett family will, will initiate the engagement ceremony to receive approval from, the, from First Sergeant James Lot for his youngest daughter, Jaquana Lott's hand in marriage. Covering, covering the events will be called Rob TV. Details will be given in an OROPD command and signal. Items need to be roses, small white Bible, engagement ring, sewing needle, sewing thread, libations, envelope, and a calabash. Service and support. To answer any further questions that Mr. Lott and his troops may have, Alfred, his mother, Elfrida Wilson, and his uncle, Reverend Dr. William Boatman, will visit the lot residence to do recon and review each step with detail. So, would you let me marry Jaquana? Bro, you got this on camera, dude. Yes. yes. Special time. Special time. Uh, it's unfortunate that her sister won't be in the area to see it, but uh, I'm sure we can we can make it work. Uh, I'm happy for him. Hello, Quanty. Uh, I see bright things in their future. They've always, you know, this op order stated that uh, they were. Uh, Go-getters, they've always been there, and I'm sure they got each other's back. Uh, you know, communications, after 28 years of marriage, uh, you know, communications, and, and, and all the things that, as a young couple, that they've uh, come across, everyone is seeing that, and it's how you persevere, how you, how you treat each other, and... I think they'll be all right, and I'll be proud to have him as a son-in-law. That's what the that's what the FL FSIO stands for, future son-in-law. <laughs> From the Kwani platoon, the DMV detachment, Kwani platoon. <laughs> <laughs>